Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we bring you the latest updates in cybersecurity. Today, we're discussing a recent incident involving CrowdStrike that impacted millions of Windows devices. Let's dive into what happened and what you need to know. On Friday, a large number of Windows devices experienced crashes due to an issue linked to CrowdStrike's Falcon sensor. This incident affected numerous organizations and users, causing significant disruptions. CrowdStrike has explained that the problem originated from a faulty update to their Falcon sensor. As part of regular operations, CrowdStrike released a content configuration update for the Windows sensor to gather telemetry on possible novel threat techniques which inadvertently led to system crash. Ease. The company quickly identified the issue and began working on a resolution. The incident impacted Windows hosts running sensor version 7.11 and above that was online between July 19, 2024, for 09 UTC and 527 UTC and received the update. Apple MacOS and Linux systems were not affected. CrowdStrike said it delivers security content configuration updates in two ways. One via sensor content that's shipped with Falcon Sensor, and another through rapid response content that allows it to fall. Ag novel threats using various behavioral pattern matching techniques. The crash is said to have been the result of a rapid response content update containing a previously undetected error. It's worth noting that such updates are delivered in the form of template instances corresponding to specific behaviors that are mapped to specific template types. For enabling new telemetry and detection, the template instances, in turn, are created using a content configuration system, after which they are deployed to the sensor over the cloud through a mechanism dubbed channel files, which are ultimately written to disk on the Windows machine. The system also encompasses a content validator component that carries out validation checks on the content before it is published. This capability is used by threat detection engineers to gather telemetry, identify indicators of adversary behavior, and perform detections and preventions. Rapid response content is behavioral heuristics, separate and distinct from crowd strikes on sensor AI prevention and detection capabilities. These updates are then passed by the Falcon Sensor's content interpreter, which then facilitates the sensor detection engine to detect or prevent malicious activity. While each new template type is stress-tested for different parameters like resource utilization and performance impact, the root cause of the problem per crowd strike could be traced back to the rollout of the Interprocess communication template type on February 28, 2024, that was introduced to flag attacks that named pipes. When received by the sensor and loaded into the content interpreter, problematic content in channel file 291 resulted in an out-of-bounds memory read triggering an exception. This unexpected exception could not be gracefully handled, resulting in a Windows operating system crash. In response to the sweeping disruptions caused by the crash and preventing them from happening again, CrowdStrike said it has improved its testing processes and enhanced its error handling mechanism in the content interpreter. It's also planning to implement a staggered deployment strategy for rapid response content. That's all for today. Stay safe and stay informed. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more cybersecurity updates. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to get notified of our latest videos.